So we've used our PEL to record power and energy logging data. We now want to transfer that data to the PEL software on our PC. We've already connected our PEL to our PC and opened the PEL transfer software, as we can see with the green tick here. Under Recorded Sessions, simply double click on the recorded session and the transfer will begin. Once it's finished loading, highlight the recorded session and click Open. The first thing you'll see on screen is the session name, when it started, when it ended, and the duration of the recorded session. You can also see that one second trend and harmonic information was selected when the logging session was set up. On the left hand side is the aggregated summary report, the one second measurement and harmonic reports, the session totals and the event log. The one minute summary shows the measurement results in graph form on the display against time. The current scale is on the right hand side and the voltage scale on the left. The cursor is currently positioned in the middle of the screen and you can read the various measurements at the cursor position, including the associated date and time the measurements were taken. To look at currents on their own, simply click on the current symbol and the three phase current graphs will be displayed. To select an individual current, click it on the left hand side. By clicking on min max, it's possible to see the minimum and maximum readings that occurred within the time defined at the bottom of the window or any specific cursor point in time. Clicking it again to deselect it, you can now move to the energy button to see the energy being used. You could also see the individual harmonics to the 50th order. It is also possible to zoom into any part of the graph by clicking on the right hand side menu and selecting zoom tool from the drop down. Highlight the area of interest by clicking and dragging the cursor. By clicking on one second harmonics, we can see a graph of each harmonic as a percentage of the fundamental over time. The bar graph symbol shows the relative magnitudes of all the harmonics. You're able to display only the first 15 or 25 harmonics, if that's all that's required, or one particular phase on its own. Alternatively, you can look at just the odd or even harmonics, or even the triplin harmonics. By clicking Session Total, you can view the energy used during the logging session. We have no data here, and the event log shows the start of the recording, and in this case, the fact that the users stopped the recording before the scheduled time. All the test data can be transferred directly into a spreadsheet, or you can select a particular time range and select the particular data that you require exporting. The spreadsheet will open with various tabs. In session totals, the unit cost of energy could be added, and the spreadsheet will calculate the actual cost of energy used during the logging session. Reports can be printed here with a preview feature to ensure you get what you want, including the minimum, maximum and average recorded values.